Brandy. Yeah. What have I been up to? Looking for Don on the internet. Searching high and low. See what he's up to. See what he's been about. I'm interested to know. Yeah, I can't believe he's not talking. Not can't believe he ain't said shit. I thought he was going to be the voice for Summer. Yeah. You think he at least come out and, you know, have a statement for helping find Summer? Something. No. So, I thought a good place to look for recent activity on a missing child would be a web page dedicated to that child. Right. FindSummerWells.com happens to be that page in Summer's case. Yeah. Not a hint. That's crazy. You think you released a statement on there or something? Nothing in three months. Not a word. Wow. So then looking at it, I thought to myself, well, let's just take a better look, right? Mm-hmm. See what they, they had been talking about. Seems like they'd been talking about their big pet peeve. Don and Candace being attacked on social media. Oh, no. Big problem with them. Page should be about finding summer. It's about protecting their asses. Catching too much heat, apparently. Yeah. Okay. Whatever. We all knew about that. Then I kept looking, and I did find something of interest. They are trying to pass a law, get a law passed. They're trying to get a bill wrote up with a lady, Miss Diane Harshbarger, representative there in Tennessee. The bill isn't about not saying negative things about parents of missing children. It's about not having phone conversations put on social media unless both parties consent. Why would you care? I guess in their case, I would. The phone calls of me out there is not, not good, not too appealing. That's what I thought too. Then I thought a little bit harder about it. And I thought, could that be a preemptive strike for court? Maybe. Is there already something out there that could be used against them? Oh, I'm sure. Now, we've got a lot of shit we'll have to calm through to look. Now, we know there's admissions of what happened in Utah and stuff to that effect. Right. We already know that's out there. But this specified new thing, to me, could have something to do with something he said regarding Summer. Yeah, just trying to cover his butt early. Right. I mean, if you go ahead and get that law passed, then it would probably be one of those things that's retroactive to when... It happened, and that would be null and void. So all of our fellow YouTube creators that have spoken to Dawn, have seen clips and all this, go back through that stuff. See if you can find something. Right. I feel like there's something maybe he's trying to hide. I think so too. He should be more concerned with other things than... Something's, I don't know. I don't think it's important. It, it's not, it wouldn't be important to most miss, parents of missing children, but it's important to him, and I think it's important to him for a reason. Yeah, there's a reason behind it. 
But I wanted to tell everybody, I think what you should do is contact Miss Diana Harshvarger. Google it. She'll come up. She did for me. And tell her, hey, how about not being worried about um, this bullshit bill apparently you're trying to help get passed. Right. And put some effort into finding some. Right. redirect your attention to yeah. something more important. Exactly. And, you know, in, instead of having a bill for that, I got a great piece of advice. What's your advice? Something most of us learned years ago. Don't drunk dial on. Yeah. You think you know that by now. Man, damn near 60 years old. Should be in the loop on that. I learned it at like 20. Yeah, never turns out good the next day, <laughs> does it? Never. Anyway, guys, look into that. Help me out. I'm going to look into it myself, but let's go back through. Uh, seems like a, a non-issue to be worried about at this time, right. so why is he worried about it? Definitely. There's a reason, I think, behind it. That's all we got. Out. See you later. Diana Harshbarger. Quit worrying about passing new shit. Worry about the stuff you got that ain't working. You have a law on the books. It's called Mandated Reporter. Everybody in Tennessee is one. I can name you five people and show you clips of them breaking that law. So instead of making new ones, enforce the shit you already got.